Hi, Dyslexic Genius here, Brad Hurt. My phone number is 864-236-1680. I'm going to show you how to repair the lid on the veneer. You can use any piece of wood. I use these spoons I found like at a McDonald's or a Starbucks. This is very thin and you need a piece of thin wood, a long toothpick, you might have to sh shave them down. What you want to do is you want to know how far all this goes back. So I use this as a probe and I slide it in here and there's exactly how far it goes in. Well this piece I've measured kind of wiggles over this way right here like that. So you're going to need some saran wrap. You're going to need a piece of cast iron or a piece of barbell weight something to weight this down with. Or you can tape it with blue, with a blue tape for painting purposes. Mach is going to help me. So what you're going to do, you're going to I use Elmer's wood glue on this. You want to make sure you get the edge with the glue. Doesn't matter if it gets on the outside because we're going to fix it. The reason you don't want to crack it. because the glue is going to come out underneath. It'll come right off the top. If you crack it, when you press down, you'll see the glue coming up here. I know this looks messy. The reason I don't inject it is I can control the amount that I put in. I'm going to push down. You can see it ooze out. You're going to wipe. You're going to hold down for a moment, let it get tacky. Because you, when you put the saran wrap helps everything not stick. And you can see here on the edge, The, the glue's coming out and it's coming down all the way down to the side. This is a real easy trick, but my piece of weight here, this thing probably weighs 20 pounds. I really glue them down. I'm going to walk away. I might go watch the Super Bowl because the Super Bowl day, but that's my tip for the day.